with the player we have an option for a jump dash. It's going to be similar to the move dash if you've already seen that one in that they can, the player can move back and forth at a faster speed or slower speed. Uh, the option for it to enable, you just want to use the jump dash, so just have this enabled. The keys to make it work uh, is going to be X on the keyboard if you're jumping in the air, and then for the joystick it's going to be the right shoulder button. And the X, if it's bound, so if you, if you push it and it doesn't work, then just double check your settings on keys. For distance, uh, this is just going to be the distance across, so how far do you want the player to dash? Um, we'll start with about a, uh, we'll do about a 20 dash uh, for a distance going across. And then the unlimited or a number of times. So for instance, if I say a number of times, I can only dash in the air three times and he'll fall back down. And then once he's down, you can either have it set to refill on land or if it's off. It means that when you land, uh, you, if you've used all your number of times, then it's actually used up. Um, so it's kind of a, just depending on how you want the character to behave with it. And then there's also the refill time, how long it takes before the player can re-jump in a, a tenth of a second here. And then the dash through collider and invincible. So we'll take a look at those and then we'll also set up for the uh, jump dash speed. I'm going to set it to 10 just so that it goes a little bit slower for us. It's not like super quick when it happens. And then we'll go ahead and just do an instant. So instead of being as increase and decrease to it, we'll just have it where it goes instantly to 10 and then uh, stops from there. All right. So with those set up, we'll go ahead and just push play. And with the character in here, let's go ahead and just do a simple jump and then dashing across. So again, very simple, um, but it does the uh, the basics for it and plays the animation and you can also go directional so if you want to go up or you want to go at angles um, it's going to go that same distance across all right and then if you're going for a combo if you do it multiple times you can do it multiple times that way all right so that's going to be basics for it and uh, that'll get you kind of going on it so you can use the dash jump and setting it up for the different speeds and the different distances.